All right, Shalom. Uh, before I get started, want to give all praise, glory, and honor to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Rakar Kodash. Double honors unto the elders and apostles at GMS who rule well. And peace and safety to the Akim across the four corners of the earth that are pushing out this truth and sincerity and putting their life on the line to do so. All right. Uh, at the beginning of the video, you seen a clip of uh, this new challenge that they got going around uh, called the condom challenge. Okay. Where, you know, these idiots uh, take a condom and sniff it. Uh, up their nose and bring it out their mouth Okay Now You gotta be A very foolish And unwise person To do that Okay Cause you can You know You can mess up You know uh, Things uh, As far as your sinuses You know And even Even your uh, Your throat as well Okay So you gotta be You know A, a fool to, to tempt a challenge like this OK, and in the videos uh, that I've watched, I've seen uh, Jake's participate in this challenge as well. OK, as, and and, you know, shit like this, Edomites are prone for, you know, they known for doing shit like this. You know, our people aren't supposed to be doing, you know, shit like that. OK, they're following following after this heathen. OK, and doing whatever they see the white man do. OK, not knowing that we're 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 better than that okay we're we're the prince of the power okay we're above all nations on the face of the earth all right now now that's pursuant to the scriptures okay now um now esau you know he's he's a base man okay he's he's uh he, shit like that is expected from esau okay um so i'm gonna read job 30 i'm gonna start at verse 6 it says to dwell in the cliffs of the valleys in the caves of the earth and in the rocks okay now who's that talking about that's talking about esau edom okay the so-called white man which are called uh caucasians okay and that word caucasian means a uh, cave dweller okay so so this here is speaking about esau it says uh, verse seven among the among among the bushes they they braided under the uh nettles they were gathered together they were children of fools okay yea children of base men they were veller than the earth okay now now base like i said you know esau is 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 a base man he's known for doing stupid shit like that Okay, creating challenges where he set himself on fire and shit, sniffing condoms up his nose, okay, and all kind of bullshit, you know, I don't keep up with, you know, all the bullshit Esau got going on, okay, because, you know, it's, 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 um, it's plentiful, okay, he's, he has a lot of bullshit going on, okay, because he's a very base man, now, it's a lot, bugs and shit, Satan, um, I'm going to go into that word base just to show you, okay, that's what Esau is, okay, where it is. It says right here, I'm going to highlight it, slot. There it is, it says low in the moral scale okay so esau edom has no morals they're very low when it comes to morals okay so they'll they'll, they'll do anything okay and here you niggas are falling right behind the so-called white man up his ass and doing all kind of idiotic shit that you see the white man do because that's in his nature okay like i said you know we're above all people we don't supposed to be doing dumb shit like that and I'm, I'm going to prove it to you, you know, pursuant to the scriptures. All right. This is Deuteronomy chapter 7, verse 6. It says, For thy, thou art a holy people unto the Lord thy power. The Lord thy power hath chosen thee to be a special people unto himself. Okay. And if you're a special people unto the Lord himself, would you be? 
should you be uh, putting condoms up your nose and pulling it out your mouth? All right. If you're supposed to be a, a holy people, a chosen people unto the to the Lord, Yahweh Shai himself, you shouldn't be doing stupid shit like like this challenge here and all the other challenges Esau be having you niggas running behind him doing. It says, um, the Lord thy power have chosen thee to be a special people unto himself above all people that are upon the face of the earth. Okay? And if you dumb motherfuckers knew that, you wouldn't be around here doing stupid shit like that. Okay? You'll, you'll, you'll hold yourself to a higher standard than Esau. You'll, you'll look down on Esau for doing stupid shit like that. Not running behind the man participating in it. Okay? Because our people are, 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 are foolish right along with the so-called white man. Because they have no knowledge, all right? And I'm going to pull that as well. Because you niggas are simple as hell, man. You know, even, you know, not boasting, but even when I, you know, before I was in the truth, I wasn't doing dumb shit like that, man. Putting, I when, when, that went across my mind to even try to sniff a fucking condom up my nose and bring it out my mouth. All right? Yeah, so so you niggas, if you knew better, you'll do better, okay? And our people are destroyed because Esau made it that way. This is Jeremiah chapter 4. Verse 22. It says, for my people, okay, and who's the Lord's people? Okay, I just read it. In Deuteronomy, the seventh chapter, okay? For my people is foolish. They have not known me. They are sadist children. And that word sadist just means stupid. Because you got to be a stupid motherfucker to put a condom up your nose and bring it out your mouth. Just stupid. When I seen that, man, I was like, oh, man, here we go again with these stupid ass challenges. And niggas run, Jake run right behind Esau and do these dumb ass challenges. Setting themselves on fire and shit. You know, uh, running each other over in the cars and, you know, just stupid shit, man. It says, uh, they have not, they have none understanding. Because if you understood, you wouldn't be doing shit like this. If you, if you understood that you are, are a holy people unto the Lord himself, you wouldn't be doing stupid shit like that if you had this understanding. Okay. It says, they are wise to do evil. But to do good, they have no knowledge, okay? And this is just one example of you dumb motherfuckers, you know, having no knowledge, you know, because, you know, put it in front of a nigga to do some wicked shit, you know, they all gun ho for that, you know, it's easy, you know, all right? They love doing shit like that, but when it comes to, uh, to the knowledge, okay, to do good, okay, versus evil, you know, they have no knowledge, all right? And didn't want to be too long on this subject. I was just scrolling through the videos, the trending videos on my timeline and, and ran across this stupid shit and, you know, and took it as an opportunity to go ahead and speak on it and do a video. All right. So, you know, I'm going to close out on that. You know, Lord willing, this was edifying. Uh, again, want to give all praise, glory, and honor to Yahweh, by Shem, Yahweh Shai, by Shem, Rekar, Kodash, double honors to the elders and apostles at GMS, and Shalom to the Akim that are pushing out the truth and sincerity. Shalom.